And uh, we wanted to just let you know, once again, the Reds' former ace last night, Johnny Cueto, stepped up. He stepped up huge, as a matter of fact, last night and got the win. Good for him. Mm -hmm. And we want to take another look now in New York, where our own Randy Rico is gearing up to reach folks all across the nation. She is giving Al Roker a run for his money on the Today Show this morning. <laughs> Randy, tell us about your trip so far. Well, guys, you just showed the World Series highlights. And I was in a local pizzeria just off Times Square, uh, Mark. I hit John's Pizza. Delicious, by the way. Nice. Uh, we were there during the World Series game. Being someone cheering for Coito yeah. amongst the Mets crowd. That didn't go over well, huh? I kept it to myself. <laughs> yeah, I, I kept it to myself as much as possible. But I was like, you know, a couple fist pumps and stuff, and it was all good. So, obviously, uh, <laughs> my trip so far has been really fun. You know, yesterday, not the prettiest day to sightsee around New York City. You know, I envisioned myself frolicking through Central Park, taking a run, looking at all this stuff. It was a downpour, guys. You know, this heavy rain we had two days ago? It was here yesterday. So, I get here. Luckily, my hotel is right across the street from Radio City Music Hall. So, obviously, I immediately wanted to start doing a rocket kick line. I figured there would be more crazy people that like to do that. Not the case. So you guys have a picture of me, I think, from my Twitter account of me standing by myself in front of Radio City Music Hall. I'm not tall enough to be a rock cat. I get it. I also was wearing galoshes, which I happen to have on now, too. So I checked that out. And then the next thing my sister and I could find that was dry happened to be uh, 30 Rock and the NBC studio. So we run into the gift shop. And I'm checking out all the Fallon merchandise and seeing stuff. And the lady comes up to me and goes, Hey, do you guys want to see the, the taping of the Seth, Late Night with Seth Meyers? Excuse me? Sure. So we got to sit in on the live taping of Seth Meyers. I'm still wearing my wristband, guys, because it was <laughs> awesome. It's a show that I've never seen before because it's on at 1.30 a.m. apparently. Right. I wake up at 2. So I miss it. It was hilarious. And apparently, awesome. you know, getting tickets to anything, and tape, the people who work here haven't been to the live tapings and stuff. So. We thought it kind of happened to people all the time, and it was totally a cool one of a, one of a, a, one of a kind experience for us. All right. Hey, Randy, just FYI, New Yorkers, we don't frolic. All right? <laughs> just, so, just so you know, okay? That might have been the problem. They thought I was one of the crazy people, huh? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Which is probably not that far off from the truth. So you're fitting in. That's <laughs> awesome. <laughs> Randy, we'll be checking back. Have a terrific morning. Uh,